I am a computer engineer in Sandia's Critical Infrastructure Systems Department, and I do cybersecurity research for process control systems, which are the systems that run the nation's critical infrastructures, such as the electric grid, the oil and gas distribution system, hydroelectric, wastewater systems, sewage, those types of things. The idea behind our organization is to develop uh, methodologies for assessing those types of computer networks, process control networks, and to develop technologies to help secure them against cyber attack. One of the major customers that we have is the Department of Energy. We're working on a project called the Virtual Control System Environment, or VCSE, where we're developing a modeling and simulation framework to model the U.S. electric grid so that we can determine how cyber attacks would play out on such an infrastructure and how we can mitigate against those. Once an attacker gets to that site, they could then have a, an understanding of how that infrastructure works and how to disrupt it, where its vulnerabilities already are. And so the concern now is much greater than it was in the past. What's great about the VCSE project is that even though computer science is at the core, experts from many fields have to work together to make a project a success. So to model the electric grid, uh, power engineers are needed, and to model an oil refinery, uh, petroleum engineers are needed, and of course, process control experts and mechanical engineers are also a big asset. And so even though my expertise is in communications protocol analysis, uh, I get to work a lot with many different interesting people from different technical backgrounds. And it's really rewarding to see how your contributions come together uh, with so many others to form a capability that's considered a national asset. The work you do is very engaging and interesting and has high impact on our national security. You have access to world-class facilities and experts in just about every technical field. The work environment is very flexible. You're allowed to work at your own pace, allowed to work your own hours, and be as productive as you can. There's no way you can go wrong.